In this video from Device Doctor, I'll show you how to fix the service required or ink pad full error on your Epson L5190 printer. No need to visit a repair shop. If you're having trouble with your printer, you can fix it for free on your own. If you have any technical questions or aren't sure which printer to buy, just ask us for expert advice and free support. When you turn on the printer, you might see ink pad full or service required, and it won't work. Just connect the printer to your computer with a USB cable to start. Now you need to download the reset file. The download link is available in the description below. Important note, disable your antivirus. Before opening the file, ensure that your antivirus software is turned off. Antivirus may delete the file if your antivirus is active, it may automatically detect the file as a virus and delete it. Now extract the file. Make sure WinRAR is installed on your computer. When you open the folder, you'll find two subfolders, one named L5190 and the other Crack. First, Open the L5190 folder. Now open the atchprog file to start the reset process. Now click OK and you will see a license error message. You need to write down your machine ID or take a screenshot of it. Now go back and open the crack folder. Now open the file named WLGenEpson5190. Don't know English well? No problem. You can watch this video in your language. Just go to YouTube settings and choose your language. Now select the first option, License Manager, and open it. Now you need to add a license using your computer's machine ID. It's very simple. Just follow the steps carefully. Now just enter any name for the license. The name does not matter, but make sure to enter your machine ID correctly and exactly. Now we will enter our machine ID. Make sure you enter your machine ID carefully, just like we do. Now save your license. Now that the license has been added, click on Create License Key to generate the license folder. Now open the license folder and copy all the files inside it. Now go back and open the L5190 folder again. Now paste all the copied files into this folder. Now open the license file and run it. Now run the edge prog file. Now 
now select your printer from the Select option. Now open the Particular Adjustment Mode option. Now find and select the Waste Ink Pad Counter option, then click OK. Now select both Main Pad Counter and Platin Pad Counter. Then click the Check button. As you can see, 23% of the printer's memory is full. The printer does not have a service problem. This is just a demonstration for learning purposes. Now select both Main Pad Counter and Platin Pad Counter again, then click the Initialize button. Now click OK to reset the printer. Now turn the printer off and then on again. Thank you for watching. If this video helped you, please like, share, and subscribe to Device Doctor for more useful tips and tutorials. Your support means a lot to us and keeps us motivated to create more helpful content.